I also got some wonderful feedback from Dr. Randy Birkin of Birkin Medical Aesthetics, and he describes how these courses have inspired his shift in the way he practices medicine every day. I'm Dr. Randy Birkin. I practice in the Woodlands, Texas, which is outside of Houston. I've been in practice for 30 years. Uh, I'm a board certified gynecologist and I took Neil's course several years ago when I started to get into age management medicine. Um, it has had a dramatic effect on how I treat patients. Uh, it is probably the most gratifying thing I've done in my entire career uh, to be able to help patients feel better, uh, get a restored vitality, kind of recreate the lives that they used to have while lowering their risk for chronic diseases is great satisfaction to me as a physician. Very often they say they, their lives are back to the way they used to be um, and they thank me immensely for it. I think an interesting twist that I learned from, from Neil is that being a board certified gynecologist he brought up the point that as a gynecologist I had to be prepared for spouses and boyfriends and significant others who would call me after I treated these female patients who would want to get on bioidentical hormones and that's exactly what happened. So now I say half my practice is actually treating men and optimizing their hormones as well and still getting a great clinical response. Once a patient becomes optimized in her hormones or his hormones they do want to take it to a different level and that in includes uh, nutritional uh, analysis and recommendations as well. And when patients start feeling better, they want to take better care of themselves. I think um, accepting the uh, repercussions of aging uh, does not have to be uh, accepted. It can be changed, we can better ourselves, we can live longer, we can live healthier, we can live happier. It's all there, and it's just a matter of getting it analyzed, getting evaluated and working with a physician who really understands the concepts of age management medicine.